loves welcome back to my channel if it's your first time coming over thank you so so much you could be doing anything else and you clicked on my video and i appreciate you so much my name is diana marguerite i hope you will love what you see you hit that subscribe button you hit that bell so you don't miss any of my upcoming uploads thank you to my ogs for coming back commenting sharing supporting my channel i appreciate you so 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 much now um this video is brought to you by clyde hair hopefully i am saying it correctly i'm trying to look for the box you'll see the box i'll show it to you in the next clip but let's talk about this wig real quick honestly i really i think i'm thinking about starting a straight out the box series because some people do not want to go through bleaching the knot some people don't want to go through having to wash the wig some people don't want to have to pluck all of that stuff even though i did a little bit of plucking it to this wig but honey you definitely could have got away with not doing any plucking especially if you just want to go for a simple middle part like i did um for me you know probably later on i'll go ahead and add baby hairs but for now this is a really really bomb beginner friendly wig um let me see if i this is a 24 inch so you guys know that i'm loving the long tresses because it is getting colder and i need my inches to keep me warm do you feel me but yes this is really really pretty i'm loving the uh body weight texture i did nothing to this hair this is everything so if you are not good at curling straightening or you're just lazy like me and don't feel like doing it that's me all you need is your hot comb or heating tool something that's going to get the little lump lumpiness at the top that every wig comes with um you know every wig comes with that with packaging so you're definitely going to need something to flatten that down a little bit but yes overall this is a really 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 beginner friendly lazy girl wig like i love it and i hate to say lazy because sometimes you just have so much many other things to do especially if you're a mom a mom to an infant like myself um it's it's too much sometimes it's just too much i haven't i don't even remember the last time i bleached a wig it was well i guess it was last month but still that's neither here nor there i didn't enjoy it i'll say that i didn't enjoy it so when a wig honestly the best thing to do these wig companies need to do is to bleach start bleaching the knots for us we'll pay a little bit extra but just you know bleach the knots for us because i don't feel like doing that like i don't i let me know down in the comment section if you enjoy bleaching knots but anyway i won't talk your ears off overall this is a really nice wig um you will see me just straight up style this wig straight out of the box let me know your thoughts down below put out into the world what you want to get back and i guarantee you will get it back love you guys and i will see you queens in my next video this is so here is what the packaging will look like when you get your wig from Kwai Hair. Um, this is what it will look like. So super cute. I love their packaging. Um, you can just tell when a company has been around for a minute and their packaging looks really good. So they did send me a headband, even though this isn't a headband wig. Uh, but they also sent me some wig caps, which I appreciate. And this is the unit. So it, like I said, it is a 24 inch bo um, body wave unit, um, four by four closure wig. And it does have um, all of the stuffing and the netting over top of it. I was just really impressed by how nice this wig was straight out of the packaging. Um, it didn't have like the best smell so i would um if you do plan on wearing this out of the packaging just spray some um dry shampoo on there and it'll get that smell out of there so it does have the fake scalp um in the 4x4 closure you definitely don't have to use that um you can cut it out um, but it does have two combs in the front a comb in the nape and adjustable straps so right here you um i'm just adjusting the straps and i'm gonna go ahead and um uh, t cut the lace off of the back because there is a little bit of lace in the nape of the hair um, but I am going to go ahead and put this unit on and this is what it looks like when um, the lace is still attached the lace um, I'm not sure if this is transparent lace or what it necessarily is it is soft of course um, because it is a human hair unit but 
it um I'm not sure what this lace is if I find out if they if I go ahead and ask Clay hair I will um update you guys in the comments section so yeah um I'm just going ahead and parting this unit in the middle um you definitely don't have to you can shift this wig you can use um that four by four parting space and just do like a slightly um uh non-centered part I guess um so whatever suits and fits your personality and what you want to do that particular day so I'm just taking some wrap foam mousse and I'm going to um go ahead and squeeze this hairline uh, this is definitely optional this is a straight out of the box like type uh, situation that I'm doing here or install that I'm doing so you definitely can skip this step if it's not what you want to do or if you're scared you're going to rip the lace or whatever the case may be um, you definitely can skip this step if you're not comfortable but for me I was I've been doing this for a while so I went ahead and just started plugging away So right here I'm just going to go ahead and uh, pin my hair up out of the way and I'm going to go ahead and cut this lace off. Um, these 4x4 closure ways are so beginner friendly because you don't have to cut so, so much lace off. Some people are just not comfortable with doing that and a 4x4 closure wig is definitely the way to go when you're not comfortable or when you're just starting out and you just kind of want to get some practice. So um, this is perfect. Definitely make sure you guys check the description box for this hair. Um, I really did like it a lot. You will see me go in with my hot comb and also with my um, wax stick um, I did I think mine is from I will leave it down below in the description box so definitely check the description box for the um, wax stick that I like to use I did get it from my local beauty supply store but I did see it online as well um, I think it's by Edge Booster if I'm not mistaken but yes it lasts it has lasted me for a while I haven't had to get a new one in months so definitely make sure you guys check it out this is me using it right here but yeah I'm going to use that in a combination with um, my hot comb just to get this um, you know the uh, top to look a little bit flatter and more natural so let me know what you guys think um, I am going to go in with some slight baby hairs just on the edge of the um four by four lace closure so nothing too drastic you definitely can skip that step as well if that's not your preference but yeah let me know what you guys think down below thank you so much Clyde hair for sending over this wig it is gorgeous and this is one of those pop on you just need you know you want to do something other than your headband wigs that you've been rocking um so this is a really really cute unit to do and just plop on your head like it's perfect and it's a perfect fit as well for me when i adjust those straps in the back so yeah let me know what you guys think down below in the comment section about this wig and i will see you in my next video go ahead and watch to the end and i love y'all